What's up everyone, Amy here. Just a quick training on how to create a test Stripe account so that you can test your order forms and payments on GrooSell. Now, before we begin, I post a lot of free step-by-step -step training here on GrooFunnels. So if you're watching one of my older videos and notice that your screen doesn't look like mine, please refer to my pin comment underneath this video as I leave updates there for you. You ready? Let's go. Okay, the first step is to log into your Stripe account. Now, if you don't have a Stripe account yet, you can create a new account at this link right here. Once you've created your Stripe account, log in, click on developers, then click on API keys. Under view test data, you want to toggle it to the right and it will turn orange. And you've got the word test data in orange as well. In publishable key, make sure it's PK underscore test because that's going to provide you the credentials to create a test Stripe account. So if we switch it back, you're going to see PK live. You don't want that. You want it over to PK underscore test. We're going to leave this screen open and open up another tab to log into GrooveSell. Once you're in GrooveSell, click on product funnels, product funnels again, we'll close out of this. I'm going to use the test course product funnel and then under the drop down arrow, click on manage products. I've already set up this product funnel with a product called test course. So we'll head over here, click on the pencil icon, click on three gateways and you want to go to the third tab set up gateways. Click on that. And I've already created a test Stripe account here for your test Stripe account. Just click on this button, click Stripe. We'll call this test Stripe. Head back to your Stripe account, click on this to copy in the publishable key, head back to GrooveSell, paste it in here, back to Stripe again, click on review test key, click on it again and copy, head back here, paste it, click create. Now I'm not gonna click on create because I've already created a Stripe account, so we'll close out of that. Then you wanna head back to this tab called payment gateways, click on credit card, head over here, click on add credit card and your test Stripe account should appear. I'll click on that, leave it set at 100, click save and then exit out. I'll open up a test checkout page. Now this order form here already has the Stripe test credit card connected. So for Stripe, you can use the following test credit card details to test your order. It's just 4242 all the way through. For the expiry date, it could be any number. So let's just enter in a random number here for the expiry. Also a random number for the CVC. So I'll just enter 567. You need to enter in a zip code to use your test Stripe account. We'll just make that up, complete purchase, click on that and it works. So I've got thank you. Now we want to log back into our Stripe account, making sure that it's still on viewing test data. Click on payments and I can see here that test course $497 has gone through. One last important thing guys, when you're done testing, please log into your group sell product funnel again, click on the pencil icon under three gateways, you want to delete your test Stripe account, click on add credit card gateways, and then you add in your live Stripe account, and then you're done. You press save and exit. All right, guys, like this video if you found it helpful. Subscribe to the channel because next week, I'm going to create more step-by-step group sale training so that you can sell more of your digital products online. And until next time, see ya.